Hello, uh, welcome back. Today is Monday the... No, it's not Monday, is it? It's Thursday. This week has been so busy, I can't believe it. Um, it's Thursday the 9th of December today. Um, I haven't been to the allotment for about a week now. I've been quite busy at home. I stupidly decided to redecorate my living room at home and um, I'm on day four now and it's still not done. Um, I actually uploaded a video about my um the progress on that onto my other channel erica's little welsh life so if you're interested in having a nosy around my living room um i'll put a link above in the cards and um, down below in the description but anyway i haven't been down the allotment for ages uh probably probably a week now and as you know with allotments you're not going to get anywhere unless you put some work in so i've got about an hour and i am going to um have a look round. uh there's some bits and pieces i want to get done on my no dig plot but firstly i thought i'd come in here and have a look at my carrots which are down here they are looking fab and um you can't see actually let me move the camera a bit this is where my onions are and they're looking okay as well really what i absolutely love and i'm totally learning about the um d doing stuff over winter is you don't have to worry if you're busy and you've got other stuff going on nothing is going to die in a day because it's so hot you know you can water these once a week um the ground here does look dry on the surface but it's it's not it's not um dry underneath so that's amazing because i can literally just look at the polytunnel once a week and know everything's going to be okay so i'm going to head over to the allotment now my no dig allotment and i'll show you um what i'm planning on um getting up to today over on that plot so what i want to start working on today um i haven't got long at all actually i've got about 45 minutes and you can actually probably do quite a lot in 45 minutes really um but down at the very bottom of my plot I've got this big raised bed here I think a previous owner used this as a um, compost heap and last year there was a couple more layers on the top there and what I did was I got rid of those because they were rotten and stuff and I thought I would use that as a raised bed for um last season but because I get so much wind coming down here, everything that I planted in there just got hit by so much wind. And we had a bit of a funny season last year and nothing did very well in there. But you can see it's full of that cooch grass. So it needs... And I did actually um, put probably about 100 litres of compost on top of there with loads of cardboard. And I did dig it over and stuff and it's still come back. So what I've decided to do with this bottom area of the allotment is I'm going to plant loads of artichokes here so that it will take a massive like a brunt of all the wind that comes along here. So what I'm going to do is start dismantling this. I've got some strawberries in there at the moment. So I'm going to take those out and then I'm going to start dismantling it. And then I can start working on get getting this area completely like dug over, ready to put some artichokes in. Um, I did a video the other day actually where I harvested a load of artichokes but after I did that video um, Kelly um, Kelly from my UK homestead she um, said she had loads of them left over so she's going to send me some so I think it's a good idea for me to start kind of digging and getting this area ready so as soon as she um, sends them to me we can get them put into the ground ready as a really good windbreak for next year. Okay so cut to today it's Monday the 14th of December and I'm so sorry that I didn't edit this video on Thursday and upload it when I planned um but basically what happened was I took out all of the strawberries and then I dismantled that compost heap area really naively I thought that the top layer would just be all cooch grass and everything and um I could kind of weed that off really easily and then get a rake or a fork or something and just kind of like put it in that area ready to be um then turned over again and add the artichokes that Kelly had sent me in the post um but when I actually dismantled that um compost heap i realized that the cooch grass is just completely growing throughout that compost heap and because it was a compost heap before there's lots of like pockets of kind of like 
air pockets and stuff in there where obviously stuff has um rotted down and it's not pushed down um and stuff and i was just thinking oh my goodness where do i start as usual i'm really um I'm I'm just not realistic when I give myself kind of um you know targets and stuff. I was hoping that I could go up there for 45 minutes, take the whole um everything apart and get it it looking really good whereas actually it really needs a good day working on that plot, you know, a day a week. Um so what I did in the end, I was kind of like digging for ages and I thought oh, what am I going to do, you know? So I just gave up and I walked off, okay? So the rest of the video is just really negative where I'm just like being a such a negative Nelly complaining about, you know, all the work that I need to do. So what I've decided is that I think I'm going to buy myself um some of that damp like damp proof um membrane, you know, the really thick plastic stuff. I did have um a thick plastic covering for my other allotment but i have um given that to someone else on the allotment that needed to cover their plot for the winter so what i'm going to do um is get myself some of that kind of um membrane stuff and just kind of cover the whole bottom end of that plot it needs so much work digging out properly and there's no point me doing half a half a job here and half a job there because it's not going to get done what i need to do is get that area covered um and then from the very top i've I've dug an area already up there that's getting cooch grass back again so i just need to kind of work on one patch and get it cleared and then go from there there's no point beating myself up about it i want to have loads of fruit bushes loads of fruit trees on that plot um so you know maybe in the future if i'm not able to really get that cooch grass out i can just weed membrane it loads or something i'm not sure um but i didn't want to not upload the video but i didn't want to include all the footage of me feeling really negative um because i know we're all negative in life and you know sometimes with social media you know people just upload the good all the time um which isn't really realistic but on the other hand um by the way i'm in a car park right now so there's like people all around me and they probably think i'm i I'm crazy talking to myself um but yes I just didn't want to be negative and um upload the rest of that video so I will leave it here for today um thank you so much for watching my video if this is the first time you watch one of my videos please do hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you'll be notified of all of my latest videos and um as ever YouTube have some videos up on the screen now that they think you'll like so please go ahead and watch those and I will see you later bye